Why? Hello and welcome everybody. It is Pox again. So today I wanted to go ahead and show you guys another really cool map on Warcraft 3. Uh, this is going to be one of the pretty much like old classics called Element Tower Defense. Now there's a bunch of really good tower defenses on Warcraft 3. And to be fair, you'll probably get bored of playing them after, I don't know, 10 rounds, 20 rounds, 100 rounds. You know, I forgot this is not on a bot. Uh, there we go. Uh, but Element Tower Defense is pretty cool because... Like a couple of tower defenses on Warcraft 3, every time you play the game, if you play on all random, you're going to have different towers with probably a different setup, and there's a whole collage of modes that you can kind of pick from. So I'm going to be playing on very hard just to kind of make it a shorter video. With all random mode, uh, game length, I'll just do normal, um, creep randomness, normal mob, and just normal. Alright, so what's going to happen now in this game is... You're going to have monsters that are coming out in 20 seconds, and you have an interest timer. You're going to see me selling and rebuilding towers constantly throughout this game. When you play on all random mode, everything is 100% refunded. So you're, if you want to play in your best interest in min-max, you're going to sell before the interest timer. You don't have to do that. It may look really annoying and tedious to you. So remember, you don't have to play like this. It's kind of just a force of habit. So you're going to get elements every five levels, so um, right now you can see we don't have any elements to build from, but you've got dark, earth, fire, uh, water, nature, and light. I also completely missed that interest timer, but that's okay. Now one cool thing is that when you play with, uh, when you play element TD in like a with a group of people, it's a lot more enjoyable because if someone finishes the race or someone finishes the um, sorry the round, you can actually like force start another round depending on like um, depending on the modes that you pick. So that's kind of another element you can add to it where you're not always playing at the same pace. You know, sometimes you're playing at a slower pace, sometimes you're playing at a quicker pace. So the interest is coming in a second, so we're just gonna actually miss that one too. I probably could have gotten a two tip from it. And uh, an easy way to tell like how how much of a difference your interest is making, if you're playing with other people, on the right hand side you can see the total gold accumulated between everyone. I guess I don't really need to try hard and interest for this video. But I'll make the game go out quicker if I don't. I'll do it a little bit. My door actually swung open too, so let me go close that. Leaked a few. Actually, so I personally really like splash towers um, as my like first my first uh, elements. So let's hope for like fire, water, or earth. Kind of really, I really like fire and water. To be honest, they go into vapor tower, which is one of my favorites. So the way this game works is. You have duo towers, right? Doubles, which is basically, you know, earth, nature, fire, water, you know, pretty much every combination of them. Uh, and you can see your current combos based off of your dual towers here, but I currently don't have any, so I can't really show you any. Then you have your triple towers, which are between three different elements, uh, and you can see that by pressing the button here on the triple elements. 
Okay, so this is actually potentially going to be a uh, resident sleeper video because sometimes you don't get <laughs> sometimes you don't get an element and instead you get interest rate. Uh, a lot of the newer players really dislike this and they consider it like the instant lose because it kind of forces you to play the try hard mode that a lot of people don't really like. This is personally what we always aim for, but for a YouTube video, it may not be the, the most enjoyable. Oh, I actually, like, really fucked that up. I'm doing a really bad job of doing this. If anyone's watched the live streams, you'll see that I'm, I'm really messing up now. It's okay. I don't really want to get too far. We'll just go to like round like 25 or 30, so we'll just try to speed it up. I want to show you guys like some of the cool towers. Uh, also at the top right you can see like the current level, the next level, the elements of them, and then the property they have. And that's really important because of like, th this is composite, there's 100% to all element types, but um, towers just like, kind of like Pokemon if you think about Pokemon. Oh, I totally could have sold that for interest, it's okay. <clears throat> so this is like reincarnation round. Reincarnation round, you pretty much want to have um, like splash for it. Same thing with illusion rounds, you would ideally want splash damage. So what are we getting? Fire? Okay, we got light. Light is good. Light's one of the uh, really far range towers. Light and dark both have a uh, really, really good attack range. Only thing is light is not good against earth. It's its 50%, I believe. But light is really good against dark. So the way I play, if you guys haven't like noticed by now, is I like to kind of wait and then... Uh, well, basically, I like to build a bunch of shit towers and then like spam resell. Um, and getting an element on round 5 really makes that a lot easier. Doing it without it is a little bit difficult. Um, not impossible, but... Actually, I think I'm going to leak here for being silly. Let's see. Let me come up here. Oh, there it's ours. 
Are we good? Oh, no, no, no. I'm good, actually, I think. Or, wait, maybe not. Okay, cool. This should work a lot better now, though. Super off on my keybinds tonight. If you get an element to tier two, uh, meaning like you just like you kind of random the element again, then you can upgrade the basic version of it, and you can also get a chance at upgrading one of your like dual towers into a tier two. So this is an illusion round, and for illusion rounds, highly recommended that you get splash damage of some type. You can also use like your basic towers here, your com your uh, cannon towers and your arrow towers, to create um, like the elemental version of it. So it's pretty good. Like if you don't have, if you get like an interest, kind of like what happened to me, and you just literally can't make any towers, you can go with these, and they're pretty good for like substitutes. Hmm. Not what I meant to do there. Yeah, I thought this music was on the whole time. Remember, light towers have incredible range. Remember to, to use it to its fullest potential. So, after this, we're gonna get another element. Hopefully we get... I don't really know what I like to pair with light. Uh, light and dark makes trickery towers, but trickery towers need a carry, so I'm not really sure. Light and uh, water, maybe, is, I think is good. Oh, cool, light and water. Oh, I hope it's good. <laughs> I think it's good. Can I kill this before the... No way. Level cell. Okay, so let's put. Let's see, what is it gonna be exactly? Is it. It's an ice tower. So, ice tower gets its light damage, so it's amplified on this. How does this thing work? Each attack sends out a helix. A frost. Units that get hit by this helix take damage. Double if hit by both parts, as the helix will also do bonus damage. So it's cool because, like, depending on how you how you place this tower, it's gonna get like so much more effectiveness. For example, right? That's what I kind of really like about Element TD. Let's say, for example, you don't want to do that. Now that I have water. I really like water as an element because it's splash damage, and you can you can still clear the early rounds like this without having like real combinations of towers, which means that I can interest. Oh, you know I forgot to double click. Oops. Just like this. Summer is complete. 
Okay, so we deal reduced damage to dark. bad positioning for these towers. Okay, this could be a uh Amplified I'm telling you man, amplified water is OP. So we we are getting a new element right now. Let's hope for, I really don't even know what to hope for, to be honest. We're leaking a little bit. Unless maybe these can catch the leaks. These cannot catch the leaks, so we leaked a few. As long as we don't get a tier two element, we're okay. Unless we get tier two water, but I'd really prefer not to. But I'll, I'll be okay with tier two water. Why did you have to give me fucking tier two water? There's like, 9,000 different combinations you could get. Well, not really 9,000, but you know, there's there's like so many other elements I could have gotten. Why did I have to pick water again? Okay, I'm just not gonna income and just kill her. Okay, fuck it. I'm gonna income again. I'm sorry, chat. I mean, you too. I mean, I love you guys. Okay. Oh, you know I'm taking so long to kill this that the next wave is already spawned? So unfortunately, I can't make a new tower, but I can make an upgraded water tower, which should destroy this round since it's uh, a fire round. I guess I, I can income pretty uh, effectively right now. Let's see. Let's start doing some, some interest. That's not what I wanted to make. So next round is a dark round and we do reduce damage to dark. It's also a dark speed, which means it's gonna be spooky. So we're gonna just literally mass a shit ton of light towers and we're just not gonna stop, okay? Okay, 
Okay, I think we're good. The question I have to ask is... Oh, we got dark. Which means I can make trickery towers. Which means I still can't make a real tower. Oh wait, yes I can. Hold on, what's my triples? I can make a hail tower. Oh, hail towers are good. Yeah, yeah, hail towers are cool. I'll show you why hail towers are cool. Um, I guess I can make a... Oh yeah, that's really about it. Okay, so this guy's gonna be a hail tower. And then this guy's gonna be nothing because I want the interest. Okay, this guy needs to be a trickery tower. So I'll make a trickery tower right here. And then the trickery tower will clone the hail tower. And it even clones it with full mana. Good job, Trickery Tower. Okay. And then realistically, I could make another one and then make another Trickery Tower and he could clone that too, but we'll do that later. So this is gonna be a, a split round, but it should be okay, because we'll like cleave everything or splash it. Come on, Trickery Tower. Oh, it's that's right, it's cooldown. Can't spam it. Re I could make a focused water as well. I mean, it's not bad to make a focused water because it'll like split with the trickery. Let's do it. Or I could just make two hail towers, which is what I was going to do from the beginning. But I've been trying to income a little bit or interest because I kind of have to. I guess I can interest with just amplified waters. No, but you see, that's the problem, is if I do that, then it consumes the uh, conjure from the trickery, so we don't want to do that. So strong. And then next round is going to be super easy because it's a uh, dark round, so we do double damage as Hail Tower. See that interest was uh, 116, 113, 116. Okay, next round is Earth, and that's kind of poo poo because we do no damage to Earth. So we're gonna kind of get prepared for the next round, and the best way to get prepared for the next round is to make these trickery towers. Second. Oh, I guess I can make a poison one too, but I don't really like that tower. And I need to do this. All amplified water. Focused water. Oh shit. Three? I clicked the wrong uh, upgrade for that one. It's okay, we messed up a little bit, but... Um, I mean, I guess I can make like some super mega amplified light towers and try to kill these guys. Oh no wait, this is gonna go back into a hail tower. And we just got T2 Dark. T2 Dark Water. Dark Water makes Poison Tower, the one I said I didn't like. I mean, I guess we can try it. So we'll make two Poison Towers here. 
poison tower. Poison tower. And then we can upgrade the poison towers to a pollution tower. So let's see how good these pollution towers are. Uh, I don't exactly understand what they do. They deal AoE damage on the target, but they don't hurt the target. They only deal AoE damage. Oh fuck, that's not good. Pollution towers, why are you scamming me, dude? <laughs> the pollution towers are scamming us. No, maybe they're bugged or something. Each attack on the same unit increases the AOE of the splash. So it literally doesn't do anything except for splash. But what? That's a very questionable tower. I'm gonna go ice into hail. I'll just mass hail towers because they're nice. This time, buddy. All right, well, it's working so far, so here we go. The trickery tower spam. Along with the uh, hail tower spam. So we just have to. What have we gotten again? I, will not be I mean, I can. If, as long as I get a. Uh, what do I need? Light T2? If I get light T2, I can get an upgraded hail tower. That would be like really strong, actually. And I could get Mirage Towers. You know, actually, that would be really crazy if I get Light Tier 2 now. Wow. Alright, here we go. Let's let's try to get lucky. Light Tier 2. We got Earth. Um, I think Earth opens up a lot of different things, though. I think Earth might open up a slower, potentially. Let's take a look. Let's look at dual towers. Gunpowder, trickery, poison, quark, hydro, ice. Okay, how about triples? Laser, oh, I can make muck. Yes, muck is one of my favorite towers. Make a muck here and a muck here. Muck is a really good slower. I, don't, I think it's a dark and then Earth, right? So, gunpowder. And then we can make a muck tower. Here we go. Flings of volatile liquid that reduces movement speed by 10%. And you can see like it's slowing because the units are getting stacked up. Then I'll make another one right here. And then I can make a laser tower, which is like a pure single target tower, but I already have enough uh, like light damage. So we're not going to do that. Let's make another muck monster instead. Definitely hoping for that tier 2 light though. Tier 2 light puts us in like a really good spot. I actually think it might be better to put the slower over here. No, well then he hits over here though, so that's good too.
All right, level 40. Don't don't mess me over, dude. Level 40. The mirror images right now are like going to town. Oh no, we have Earth coming up. This is our reduced round. Are we gonna solve for amplified waters, or are we gonna just try to just? I think we just face tank it up, man. Here, maybe this will help a little. It doesn't really do too much. The slows, though, man. I'm telling you, these slows. They're so good. Didn't get a time, a chance to rebuild here. Oh, whoops! I think I just like messed up there. I just made. I mean, I kind of messed up, but at least it kind of works. I made them in the wrong spot, but I still have the trickery towers, so they still work. <laughs> Uh, I'm probably gonna leak some here. I took way too long to like build them. It's okay. It's fine if I leak some. Pretty okay on lives. So you need to be sold. You need to be sold. And you guys need to be upgraded. I got light T2, boys. I'm really excited. Light T2 means... Well, how do we kill it, though? Okay, I have the single target to kill it. This is really big. Okay, this means we make another dark tower here. We're gonna sell everything down here. Make our trickery tower mirage tower. Make another mirage tower. Upgrade these three to comet towers, I think. At least this, these two here. Like that. I also think I'm going to make another trickery tower here that's only going to be for this muck tower. Which means I can sell him. And I don't really need this right now either. Okay. Really nice. What else can what else can we make though? Like what's um let's look at these doubles. Oh, dark earth. What do we have T2? We do have dark and earth tier two, so we can actually make we can make these uh these other boom boom towers. Let me, let me put some of them here. Um one, two, three, four. They're gonna go, I think, I forgot what they're called. Oh, wait a second. No, 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 Maybe I should put them here? No, 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 I'll put them here. Let's go like one, two, three, four, like that. And the reason why I'm doing this is because they're gonna have a different damage type. These guys are earth damage type. And then these upgrade... Oh wait, no, I forgot these are Earth. Oh, wrong tower. Well, let me look then. I have dark, I have water, I have light. 
So this goes into... Speaking of which, this is a reduced round. Am I doing okay? Okay, whoopsies. Whoopsies, a little bit of a misplay. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Okay, we can do the upgraded poison, which we didn't like. We can make hydro, which I I don't really like hydro towers. So what is what does light and earth make? I only have Earth Tier 1, though. Orc Tower. Upgrade. Let's go Comet Tower again. Let's make another one. Oh, I can make the the upgraded freezing tower. That's what else I can make. Um, I mean, I guess I can try like one freezing tower, like right here. I think that's a good spot for the helix because of like the way it hits. It like hits them on the. I think it, it looks like it is a good spot. More light damage, though. I'll make this one another Comet Tower as well. We got ma light tier 3. Um, that's... That's pretty bad. Um, one, because I'm not going to be able to kill it. Or maybe I will be able to kill it. No, I'll be able to kill it. It's bad because I can't do anything with it right now. But it's good because I really like Light Pure, which is an elemental type. Now I need to get a pure limit, which then I can make like the super light towers. It's also bad because, yet again, we're stacking the same exact thing, which is light damage, but we're not really getting too many options. Still seem to be pretty good. What trickery is this? Next Earth round may like KO us though. Let's see, do we have an Earth round coming up soon? I hope we don't. I don't think we do.
surprised we're still alive with relatively like no CC either. Should probably put another muck tower like right here. But next round is gonna be easy. I don't know what round 50 is. That's good. That means we'll live to get another element. I don't know what we want, though. Maybe Tier 2 Earth? I don't know what Tier 2 Earth does exactly. Nature. I think nature would enable a lot of slows. Yeah, na nature would enable, like, Supernova Tower and, uh... Maybe I need fire, too. No, I don't think I need... Oh, I think I do need fire for Supernova. Shit. What do I need for T2 Muck? Earth? Okay, I want, I want Earth, then. Because my best investment is to just stick with, like, Muck Tower Slowers. But it's not really up to me. It's AR, so. And actually, next level, round 51, is an Earth round. So we're probably dead on that round. If we don't die on this round. I mean, I could try, like, a bunch of Polar Towers. I've never used a Polar Tower before, though. I don't really want to switch. Even this, just this round was tough, and it's not even, like, anything special. Water T3. That means we're making the Mega Giga Poison Towers. The problem with the Mega Giga Poison Towers is that we've tried them and they don't seem very good, but I guess it's time to try otherwise. <laughs> one over here. And one down here. So, upgrade. Your poison and your poison for sure. Pollution tower, pollution tower, um, gunpowder tower. Oh, this is water and dark. No, 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 no. I got. Oh shit! I'm making the light tower. This one. I'm making a sub-zero tower. Okay, never mind. Sorry, wrong one. I think we're already dead though. Re. Unless maybe. It's not gonna come in time. Quicker! Sub Zero Tower! We'll never get to see their full potential, but from what it seems like. Sub-Zero doesn't seem to be a winner in Element TD. <laughs> anyway, that's pretty much about it. Um, I guess I probably could have made, like, super mega amplified water towers. That probably would have been better. But I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of the game. I didn't really want it to be super try-hard. I kind of did with interest, but then I got fucking lazy, so. Anyway, that's pretty much the game. There's a lot of different modes to check out. You can see all the stuff in the game itself. Um, but yeah, Element TD, you can play it solo, or I think it's up to eight people. Feel free to check it out. Um, I personally use uh, Ent Gaming for my hosting. And remember, if you're interested, feel free to check out my stream anytime at twitch.tv slash box. Hope you guys had a wonderful time, and I'll see you boys all tomorrow. Take care, everybody.